How's it going ladies and gentlemen, this is Jeff with iDownload Blog. I'm going to show you how to perform a tethered jailbreak on iOS 6 on your A4 device using Resno 0.9.15 Beta 1. First of all, place your device in the DFU mode by holding the home and power buttons for 10 seconds. After 10 seconds are up, release the power button and continue holding home. Then you'll see a black screen like this. Now let's load up Red Snow 0.9.15 Beta 1. If you don't have it, download it from IDB and you should see where it's connected below. Click jailbreak and then it'll start the initial jailbreak process here. First of all though, you have to choose to install Cydia just like this. It should already be selected. Go ahead and click next with that checked and then it'll actually start processing the the real jailbreak portion here. So you should see all this information here, matrix mode. I've sped this up considerably so you guys aren't placed on hold for a long period of time. This takes anywhere between, I say five, five to seven minutes to do all this. Moving applications is probably the biggest portion of it. It takes quite a bit of time to do that. So I sped it up, just keep that in mind. But one thing you have to keep in mind, again, this is a tethered jailbreak. You notice here on Red Snow, it says uh, the jailbreak for this device is currently tethered. This means you have to perform a just boot on your device. So let's go back here. Let's place our device back in the DFU mode once it loads up to the home screen, just like we did it first. So home and power, 10 seconds, release power, continue holding the home button for 10 additional seconds. And your device should be black like this. Now you want to go back to the main page of Red Snow. You should see where it's connected below DFU mode. Click extras, click just boot, and then it should go through with the tethered boot. Now you'll see this new option below, a couple of new options actually, auto boot. I'll talk about that in another video, so don't worry about that. Now you should see the pineapple logo on your device here. That is a good indication. Now, that also takes a while to perform. I've sped it up significantly just so you guys aren't placed on hold. And for some reason, my iPhone's really slow. This is an old iPhone 4. And City hasn't popped up yet, but it should here sometime today. There we go. So the hard part's done. Everything's done. All you need to do is just go ahead and load up Cydia, and then you can choose which type of setting you want to use as far as user or hacker or developer. If you want to see everything, just choose developer. That'll show you all the packages. And that's it, folks. That is how you jailbreak a tether jailbreak, but a jailbreak nonetheless. iOS 6, it will install Cydia. You don't have to go through SSH, any manual Cydia installs. That's the nice thing about this new version of Red Snow. And just to prove that I'm running iOS 6, for you doubters out there, there we go. Version 6.0. So that's how you jailbreak iOS 6, folks. This is Jeff with iDownloadBlog.